Hello everyone, it's time for another long set of videos. So welcome back to the book corner. I am Hermione, author and lover of all good things literature. So I finally got around to start reading A Deadly Clinch, Cliche or Clinch, whatever you pronounce it. So I'm currently on chapter five and there's about, um, There's about 18 chapters in the book, so you're going to get roughly about four videos that I'm going to be doing as a whole, and then put them together and all that jazz. So in this one, this is the second book in the series, and once again, our favorite uh, protagonist is doing what she does best, take care of this little thing and uh, find herself in the middle of another mystery. Um, so... She's so so from the cover it looks like she's at the beach and she's probably having a really great time. In all like honesty, um, I really did not understand the first four chapters of this book. I really did not, and I don't know if it's because I've been reading so much today that my brain just disengages from the rest of my body. But the first four chapters absolutely made no bit of sense. So I'm hoping as I start scaling back on how many books I'm reading at one time, I will finally grasp this. So there's still hope. There is still hope for me. So, uh, yeah. All right. Uh, so, yeah, uh, it's raining outside. It's, it's, it's like pouring down rain. And uh, I got home just before it started, like, downpouring. Like, my brother is stuck at work. Uh, but he's... He's going to call a lift ride to get him home, so, yeah, there's there's hope. <laughs> it's absolute hope. Okay, so, um, I am back with the book. I have read chapters 5 through 11, five, 5 through 10. I'm now in chapter 11. I have about, um, I have about eight more chapters to go, so I will have this book finished not tomorrow, but the next day. And what I'll end up doing is I'll just end up uploading it the next day. So like, <clears throat> you're not gonna get you're not gonna get this video until Sunday. So, yeah, it's just how it goes. All right. So, um, so this time, uh, I really paid attention to what I was reading uh, and everything. And what's going on in this is. <clears throat> that she's currently working on another book. So apparently she sold her first book. Now she's working on her second book. It's like a romance kind of thing. Um, and what she's learning is there's just something really weird going on with what police are discovering. Um, everything is a uh, cliche, like um, a deck without queens. Um silver spoon, you know, in a child's mouth. These are all cliches. And we don't quite know how those cliches are connected to the to the victim. We don't really know. Um, but she is determined to find out how are these cliches um, connected. So, uh, overall, despite the fact that I'm still somewhat, um, dead tired, <laughs> um, I did enjoy, I did enjoy the, uh, five chapters. Okay, so, uh, I will be, I will see you guys next time. Hello, everybody. Okay, so... All right, so I have read chapters um, 11 through 15 of this book. And um, before I begin, I want to say this. Um, I am so very happy <laughs> to have that horror novel finished because now I can really dive back into my books. So yeah, so with that announcement out of the way, <laughs> let's continue on. So uh, once again, uh, she's just going around and trying to find clues and find out what the heck is going on and I will be absolutely honest this book is so confusing 
It absolutely is. I'm sitting there, or I'm sitting there, and I'm reading this book, and I'm like, okay, what the heck is she doing? And I must say this, um, I really did love the first book, but this one is really trying my patience in the trying to understand what the heck I'm reading department. Because I'm just not getting it. I am just not getting it. And we are down to the last three chapters of the book, which I will be finishing this book later on today, and I will do another uh, video, and I will give a um, an overall impression of the video, oh, not video, all impression of the book, and then this thing is going back to uh, the library. <laughs> Definitely going back to the library. Hello, everyone. Okay, so uh, at the time that this video is done, or this section of the video is done, or final section of the video is done, it is currently Sunday. Uh, yes, the week is finally over to a certain extent. I'm very happy. So I finally finished A Deadly Cliché by uh, Ellery Adams, and I am going to just end this video by saying this was an extremely disappointed read. I mean, not only, not only do we never find out who is actually doing it, but... It just, I went back to like, like the chapters, like, okay, where did I miss who the killer is? And it never mentioned who the killer was at all. It's just like, she just found out her father was alive. And, and I know that my eyesight is not to the point where I can't read who the killer is. I'm just like, okay no killer and no explanation to what what was the point of this book what was the absolute point of writing this book when you're not going to reveal who the killer is and you're not going to talk about or he or she's not going to explain why they did it i just i don't i don't know i don't know um generally in any book that i read that's a murder mystery uh, the killer always reveals himself and the reason why they did it. This one did not at all. I don't. I don't know where the killer is at. I don't know who killed the, the person or persons. I don't know. I don't know. This book was confusing and absolutely pointless. Like, why did you write this book? Why the fuck did you write this book? I don't understand. So I'm going to give this an abysmal one star. This book was so god awful. It's not even funny. Because I ain't laughing. Yeah. Um, so before I end this video, next month is Stuff Your Kindle Day. And I believe it's like the latter part of... Um, let's see if I can find my phone. Um, is going to be um, October 24th hosted by the Cozy Mystery Book Club offering Cozy Mystery ebooks. So, yeah. So, uh, so mark your date if you are if you want discounted or free uh, Cozy Mystery uh, books, then definitely check that out. Um, I'm actually going to be stuffing my Kindle Fire full of um <laughs> full Kindles, uh, Kindle, uh, uh, titles. All right. I will see you guys around.